Rated M for Mature. I'm Daniel Cady, lead designer on the Dawn of War 2 series, here to talk about new additions to our multiplayer armies. Soon, the armies of Chaos will arrive to sow death and destruction throughout Subsector Aurelia. Fortunately, new units are being added to the Space Marines, Eldar, Orcs, and Tyranids, free to all Dawn of War 2 owners to combat this new threat. Though if you want to use them to wreck up some other armies, be our guest. The Weird Boy is an orc with the dubious gift of Psyker powers. The civilized races of Warhammer 40k trained for ages to harness the powers of the warp, but when used by the savage Weird Boy, they guarantee madness and destruction. He provides valuable artillery-like firepower, though he's just as happy to throw his allies into the fray. When faced with a mass of opponents, he will hit it like the foot of an angry god, quite literally, by using the nuke-like Foot of Gork ability. Just don't stand too close to him if he takes a lethal wound. For those who like casters that don't explode as much, there's the Space Marine's Librarian, a trained psyker who excels at enhancing his battle brothers, as well as in direct combat. Armed with either a deadly melee force sword or a force staff to channel his psychic bolts, the Librarian's abilities bolster specialized tactical squads. He also bears remarkable protective powers. His shield wall spell propels an expanding barrier that no infantry or projectile can breach. Two new units join the Tyranids' ranks. Tyrant guards are armored monsters, created by the hive mind for defense. They move into battle using a barreling charge, protected by their thick shells and an ability to hunker down and regenerate, even in the midst of combat. This makes them valuable both for absorbing enemy fire and for spearheading a Tyranid force. Where there's a Space Hulk, there's Tyranid Gene Stealers. These elite melee units camouflage when stationary, waiting at critical points to ambush the enemy. Unlike the stealthy Lictor, which harasses and snipes unprotected opponents, Gene Stealers engage their foes directly in numbers, bolstered by a damaging Frenzy ability, slaughtering anything they can reach. The Eldar are known in Warhammer 40k lore as a dying race, but when life gives you ghosts, you make ghost robots. Wraithguard are armored shells piloted by the spirits of fallen Eldar warriors. They're sturdy, fearless, and armed with a gun that basically fires black holes providing heavy-ranged infantry support. When led by an Eldar Warlock, they move rapidly, laying down a wall of explosive fire that can rip apart any armor. These new units will join all Dao 2 players' armies in March, absolutely free. And when the Chaos Army arrives in the Chaos Rising expansion, they're going to need them. Thanks for watching.